it's important for Americans to understand. You know, there's nothing in the American media about this. No, I was trying Even to like Google on the about Daily it. Wire. I, I, I'm shocked that they're not talking about this because this is this is everybody's watching. The countries are watching. The rest of the world is watching. Yeah. If this goes through, I mean, you know, wow, we can get away with that. You're going to see the same things that you see right now <clears throat> in America. Like we've had sex ed in schools for years. Mm-hmm. We've had all these things being pushed and look at where we are right now. And right now there's a whole bunch of countries that are defending life and family. And if this passes, then we're going to lose that as well. Absolutely. And and there's a, there's a couple other aspects to it. Um, you know, with Henry Kissinger just passing and everything, mm-hmm. and HLI has has spoken now on the Kissinger report that came mm-hmm. out, and um, just was in the seventies. Yeah, with Father yesterday, which will be coming out soon. Right, and it's and it's it's important to understand this because this is a part of American history, and it's still moving American policy. Mm-hmm. And this ACP EU agreement falls right in line. Okay. So here's like the brief Kissinger report thing for <laughs> listeners, because I didn't know about it before I came here. Basically it's the official U S policy on population, which is targeting countries around the world to reduce their populations so that we have access to their natural resources. And like I said, there'll be an episode on that coming soon. So keep an eye out for that, but that's the brief two sentence summary. Yeah. Super dark. Yeah. Um, so there's that aspect. I mean, this really does follow fall right into that. We, we're going to reduce Namibia's, you know, po- population. You got this population because we're we're going to keep them sterile. We're going to keep make sure everybody's having abortions and, mm-hmm. and all of that. But the other part of it, the big part of it that Americans need to understand, is this has the potential to give the EU controlling interests in UN votes. So <laughs> when we're going into the UN as Americans. Mm-hmm. And there's a treaty or there's a decision to be made that will affect America, will affect the United States. The EU is going to have way more votes than we will. Wow. Yeah. And they're going to have controlling votes because part of this agreement obligates these countries to side with the EU in arbitrary, undisclosed upcoming votes. Wow. It's madness. It's absolute madness, and it is something that is globally devastating. And nobody is talking about and it. And nobody is talking about it. I have literally looked up news articles trying to understand this thing better, and one was all in French, and I think it was from one of these countries. I think it was from Nigeria. It was just all in French, and I was like, it, Google wouldn't even translate it for me. I was like, <laughs> thanks. Absolutely <laughs> not. <you know. laughs> yeah, it, that's crazy. It's insane. So uh, it is really, really something that needs to be addressed um you know hli is talking about it we're the ones out there talking about it we're the ones fighting it Mm -hmm. um we just need everyone to listen yeah um and start talking about it and tell your friends and then donate to hli so that we can do what we can to stop this and you can help us that's right and we can we can continue to get our people out there right now because we don't have the money to travel Mm -hmm. we're emailing we're calling um cultural leaders parliamentarians ambassadors Mm -hmm. for all of these countries um it would be great if at some point we can travel yeah. and and see them face to face it's not over yet we're still in it so yeah. 